Angelina Jolie is an American actress, filmmaker, and humanitarian. So when we heard that Angelina Jolie had bought a new home, we expected nothing less than an absolute luxury. So in this video, we're going to tell you about inside Angelina Jolie's $25 million mansion close to Brad Pitt. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick till the end. Angelina owns a property in the jungle of Cambodia. It's here in Cambodia, which has actually caused quite a bit of controversy. Apparently, the actress purchased the land from a war criminal, but hasn't commented on this. Although we haven't seen much of Angelina's secret hideaway, it's said that she bought an 18.5-acre plot of land in Cambodia back in 2002 from a commander charged in 2015 with mass murder. The notorious commander is said to be responsible for the deaths of 600,000 people about 40 years ago, but reports say he received $35,000 from Angelina to vacate the huge patch of land. Angelina and her children often spend holidays in this jungle, and it doubles as a compound for her charity and JP Foundation. Since the initial land purchase, the actress has added onto the property, building a getaway home and a forestry base for her charity. Villagers have claimed she's planning an eco-resort on the once heavily landmined site. Despite the dark past of this land, Angelina has created a beautiful home here and has been working for almost two decades to help conserve the environment and support local communities. Although we haven't seen much of her house and details are kept private, she shot a perfume commercial here in summer 2019. The behind-the-scenes video shows some of Angelina's property, including the traditional Cambodian longhouse and tropical surroundings. Considering Angelina and Brad were the most famous couple in the world, at one point they had to go above and beyond when purchasing real estate, especially to house their large family. The Chateau Miraval seemed up to their standards, which is essentially a castle and vineyard in the south of France. The spectacular property lies in France, and Angelina and Brad scouted the land via helicopter, leasing it for three years before finalizing the purchase. By 2001, the duo reportedly spent six to seven million dollars to buy the chateau. The property boasts 35 rooms in an estate situated on an ancient Roman road. This 17th century estate is straight out of a fairy tale, with fountains, a private lake, and a helicopter pad. Angelina's previous French castle sat on 1,200 acres of land apparently and hosted an award-winning vineyard where their own wine is produced. Despite the beauty of the Chateau Miraval, it may have been too good to be true. It became a major point of conflict for Angelina and Brad once they split up, going back and forth in court deciding what to do with it. Angelina wanted to keep the estate because it was allegedly her idea to purchase it. Brad wasn't letting it go that easily. By the end of 2019, the former Flame still co-owned the Chateau Miraval and continued to produce a lot of wine. So, who knows what's going on? When it came time for Angelina to start fresh and move into a new home post-divorce. Of course, she found a luxurious estate for her and the family in Los Feliz, the Just Cream's old Hollywood charm. Angelina's new property is situated in the historic Laughlin Park enclave in Los Feliz, LA. Set in a 2.1-acre estate with views across the city and the ocean, the stunning Beaux-Arts mansion and it's named after pioneering filmmaker and former owner Cecile B. DeMille. Angelina's mansion was built in 1913 and most of the estate recently went through a thorough restoration, digging six years to complete. In total, there's about 11,000 square feet of living space divided between more than one structure, as well as six beds and ten baths. It's really just as massive as you'd imagine. The home sits on 2.1 acres of land in a gated and private Long Island Park community, offering breathtaking views about the city and the ocean. Angelina's main house on the property spans 7,500 square feet and apparently it underwent the largest revamp. Although the original style of the house was kept intact, every modern amenity you could think of was added. The bedrooms boast large terraces with breathtaking views, and the winding staircase is a feature within itself. Arched French doors and other touches all play a role in keeping the old Hollywood vibe alive here. The intricate architecture and detailed designs are a theme through Angelina's home. The main residence is an Italian revival villa, and walking in the grand home has a spiral staircase, double-height ceiling, and dark hardwood floors. Other common areas here include a step-down living room with a fireplace and a mahogany-paneled formal dining room with another fireplace. In total, four fireplaces can be found throughout the estate. Other areas for Angelina to hang out with the kids include a spacious library with high ceilings and built-in bookcases, a family room, and an adjoining office for study. Her updated kitchen offers another casual dining area set against Against arch windows. You'll find the bedrooms and several bathrooms which have kept the original Art Deco style of the property as well. We can see Angelina's master suite here holds another one of those gorgeous fireplaces. In addition to the main home, there is a separate pool house in the property with a state-of-the-art gym as well as a tea house and a self-contained guest house. The grounds of Angelina's family mansion are for rose gardens and manicured lawns and mature trees which the tea house overlooks. There is also a swimming pool with classic arched fountains on either side and elsewhere, a gated motor court and a detached garage. What is your opinion about Angelina Jolie's $25 million mansion? This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Bye!